Hello, it's Jimmy here at O'Reilly's, and today we're looking at a Saab 93. It's got an uh, engine light on, and it's in limp mode, basically. It's the one with the key down here, and we turn the ignition on, it says time for service, but we're going to start it up. Took a little bit of time there. It is quite cold outside, it's about, um, it's just above freezing. So you got the engine light on. Okay, we'll switch it off. We'll do a diagnostic scan. So it's just running through various different items on the car. So we're just going to pause there. We're going to go back to the engine. So that's what we're looking at. We're not really concerned about the airbags and stuff. Done. We can go back in here. So we've got P0404, and then you've got the variations of dash one, zero 01 and dash 02. Exhaust gas recirculation performance. Okay, so what this guy's saying is he's had this EGR valve done. Uh, he's had it out of the garage a few times, and he doesn't want to replace it again, so he just wants to go with a carbon clean on it. We're going to use some of this Revive Cleaner. Uh, it just goes through all of the uh, inlet and hopefully we'll get it all working we'll break down the soot carbon that's in the engine and uh, hopefully get the car back on on track we've just got the uh, attachable spray nozzle for the top and if you see there it's for diesel engines and it removes the deposits from inside so we're going to start the engine of the car and we're going to put this on the accelerator it's a laser 3237 depressor so with the engine running, we've attached this between the seat and the pedal there and we're just going to squeeze it until we get to about 2000 RPM. So these nozzles are a little bit temperamental so we're just going to use our own bottle. And we'll turn it off and let it sit for five minutes and we'll repeat the process again. Okay, so we're going to start the car up, repeat the process three times. This is the second time, we're going to do it three times. Now we're going to do it the third time. Now we'll do the final step. was another variation of the code there that obviously came up. So we're going to clear all of these now and uh, take it for a test drive. Okay, so they've been cleared. We're going to start the car up. This is uh, obviously the time for service. It's a separate issue. Test drive's all done. All looks well and we'll have a happy customer. See you in the next video.